I'm Councillor Marie Goldman, the Deputy Leader of Chelmsford City Council. It's the start of an incredibly difficult time for all of us. Every day we're hearing about countries closing shops and borders, people being told to stay at home, and many of us are understandably worrying about the best way to keep ourselves, our loved ones and those around us safe. The government in the UK relies on district councils like Chelmsford City Council to lead in our local areas and help everyone to understand and follow national guidance. So what can you expect from us? Well, you can expect the most essential services to carry on. Council staff who can work from home are encouraged to do so, but all the council's most vital services are running as normal. We have plans in place to keep the most important things like food waste and black bin collections going. So even if we are short staffed or changes happen, these services will not stop. The latest guidance as of today, Tuesday the 17th of March, is that we should all avoid pubs, clubs, theatres and other such social venues from now onwards. We don't know how long this is going to last, but it's important that we all follow this advice. That's why we will be closing Chelmsford City Theatres from today. If you have bookings, don't worry, you will be refunded. For the moment, our museum and leisure centres, including Riverside, will remain open. However, we are already taking extra measures to keep our public venues clean and to look after our customers' health. This means, for example, that we may limit exercise class sizes to allow for extra distance between people and some activities may not run as usual. If the government says that all public places have to close, then we will close them. The situation both in the UK and around the world is changing rapidly, and by the time you watch this, some of the information may already be out of date and some of the advice may have changed. We will always do our best to give you the latest, most accurate information that we possibly can. Unfortunately, there is already fake news circulating online, so if you read something about one of the council's services and you want to check it, you can always visit our website at chelmsford.gov.uk or get in touch with us on social media. We'll be putting even more effort into responding to people's inquiries at this difficult time, but please bear with us. In the meantime, there are things that we can all do for our communities and our country. Keep an eye on people you know who are self-isolating and need supplies dropping off at their doorstep. When you go shopping, buy only what you need for your household and leave enough for everybody else. Wash your hands, cover your coughs and sneezes. Even if you don't think you have coronavirus, we should be acting to prevent passing on the infection to others rather than just protecting ourselves. In these extraordinary times, it's essential that we do all we can to help each other. This situation is scary and we're all in it together. We don't know how long it will last, but it won't last forever and life will eventually go back to normal. Look after yourselves, look after each other, and look out for all of the coming advice to keep us all safe.